It's the UEFA Champions League album, of course, from Panini from the 2007-2008, a historic season for the English teams. There's the introduction stickers, the famous Champions League trophy, and the official football that season. That was the um, final programme. Plus there's um, AC Milan, the current champions, and a fair play sticker. We start with the current champions, AC Milan, followed by Arsenal, Barcelona, Benfica, a team from Turkey I cannot pronounce. Warren Bremen, Celtic, Chelsea, the finalists, who missed that penalty, CSK Moscow, doesn't Roman, the Chelsea chairman, actually also own CSK Moscow, or have a stake in the club, leave your comments below. Inter Milan Lazio Liverpool the 2005 winners and the 2006 runners up Olympic <laughs> we'll just call them Leon Manchester United, the champions of the Premier League that season and they won the Champions League final. Wasn't that bad of a final, was it? Marseille. Olympiakos with their old goalkeeper that I can't pronounce. They're always there. Either they don't really progress far, do they? But they're there to take part. FC Porto. PSV Eindhoven. Glasgow Rangers. Real Madrid. AS Roma. FC Schalke 04 uh, Some team from Ukraine I can't pronounce them Sporting Club de Portugal or commonly known as Sporting Lisbon or the team Christian Ronaldo started his career with before joining Man United Stuttgart, Valencia, FC Domino Kiev of Ukraine. I think that's Feribachi of Turkey. Might have got that right, might have got that wrong. Rosenberg of Norway, Seville. Course of Spain, Slavia Prague from the Czech Republic, and we finish off. I think with this Romanian team, we'll just call them Bucharest. Previous winners: Real Madrid, FC Bayern Munich, Real Madrid, Juventus. Of course, FC Porto, oh, that was, no, it was AC Milan, sorry about that. <laughs> of course, Liverpool, dramatic, FC Barcelona, and then AC Milan getting revenge on Liverpool. A water bottle, fair play. Or oh, how do all the sticks in all the other countries? And again, UEFA fair play at the back. Album would have cost you 99p in England. And there's the album, officially complete. 
got this finished in about 2014. Took a bit of time, but we got there in the end. Anyway, thank you for watching this video, and I'll say goodbye for now.